I think we have a privilege of seeing with our own eyes the words of the book materializing and becoming a reality. In the history of mankind, there has never been a nation that has left its homeland and returned to its homeland. Not after 2,000 years. In 1916, when my grandfather first moved to Israel, there were 60,000 Jews in Israel. Exactly 100 years later, there are over six million. Never in the world has there been a population explosion from 60,000 to six million as we've seen here in the land of Israel. It's unprecedented. Something is happening of historic proportions. The world's actually constantly going through changes, but I think we're experiencing a hyper switch. Something's moving quicker. We're living in times of prophecy. It says, I will bring you in from the four corners of the earth and people will know that you are my people and that I am your God. Here we see something so epic, so huge, so historic, promised in the Bible. It's something that people couldn't have imagined 50 years ago. God says in Jeremiah, no more am I going to be known as a God who brought you out of the land of Egypt. I'm going to be known as a God who brought you out of the land of the north and the other countries. And when he brought back the people from the land of the north from Russia, he was saying something else. He's saying, no more am I going to be known as the God of history. I'm going to be known as a God of now. Open up your eyes, watch it happening. I'm on the move. There are more Jews studying the Bible today than ever before in Israel's history. Every single promise is now coming to pass in our lifetime. And what that does is it inspires people to want to be a part of it. They feel a calling in their life to say, if God is with Israel, then either I'm moving to Israel or I'm standing with Israel. I'm helping Israel, I'm supporting Israel. I want to be a part of that. Some truly feel I have the opportunity to be part of what God is doing in this land. And that doesn't only mean Jews, that means those that stand with God wherever they are. When Isaiah said that all the nations will be streaming like water to the Temple Mount, he was talking about you from Missouri, from Washington, from California, from Brazil, from Tunisia, from Indonesia. So if you want to connect to the essence of the whole thing, the place where God chose to lay His divine presence, you got it. This is it. With the dawn of each new day, life is returning to the land of the Bible. And around the world, millions of believers are feeling drawn to this place. Now is the time to chart your own journey, to discover for yourself the miracle of the land and the courageous hearts of the people of Israel. I am Israel. I am Israel! I am Israel! I am Israel! I am Israel. I am Israel! I am Israel! I am Israel! I am Israel. privileged to have grown up in a land where my grandfather, where his forefathers only dreamed of seeing built one day. To me, Israel, it's the best proof God exists and still acting in our world. It says, I will bring you in from the four corners of the earth and people will know that you are my people and that I am your God. God says, mountain, shoot forth your branches, give forth your fruit, my children are coming home. Every fruit you see is prophecy fulfilled. Discover for yourself the miracle of the land and the courageous hearts of the people of Israel. I am Israel. This is home, and home is where you want to be. Visit IamIsraelFilm.com to begin your journey.